Hello, I am Ram Gopal from presentationprocess.com. In this edition of PowerPoint Effects tutorial series, you are going to learn how to create designer numbered list in PowerPoint. Whenever you think of numbered list, you see lists like this where the numbers are separate from the associated text box. What if we could have a numbered list where the numbers merge with the text box like the way that you see here? It is not as easy as it looks. Let me show you how. Let us take a blank slide. Let me add a number here, say 1. Let me use a bolder font like Arial Black and let us really make the font size huge, say 96. It is quite easy to have an associated text box for a number like this one by just drawing something like this and making the shape outline as no outline. You can easily have maybe you can have the color of this match with the color of uh, the number uh, I am assuming that this color is say this and the color of this is pretty much matched you can do the minor adjustments here and say 0 0.96 or 0.98 rather and there it is you have the number and associated text box merged maybe you can have it grouped but what if instead of this number 1 if you had to use number 3 now it doesn't look as beautiful as what you see here so how do we make sure that we have these creative designer numbered list in PowerPoint it's extremely simple and this also shows you a very important property of the text and the way you can manipulate the text using merge shapes. Let, let me show you how to do this uh, for number 3 and once I show this for number 3 the same thing ap applies to uh, other numbers as well. So I am going to move this over this number. Maybe I can increase the size so that it is uh, pretty much covering the end to end here and I'm going to make the size slightly bigger so you can follow exactly what I'm doing. I want to remove some portion of this overlapping shape so that I can see number 3 here and then from there that the text box should appear. What we're going to do for that is we're going to select this number and this box and we'll go to format and this is possible in 2013 you can also use 2010 by shape subtract and all that stuff but I am showing it in 2013 because it's extremely easy there I am going to use the option called as fragment fragment shapes as soon as I do that you can see that PowerPoint treats this number as a shape and it does fragmenting just the way it would do to any shape. Now I can click on this piece, delete, click on this piece, delete and I can have all these others selected and I can go to format, merge shapes and I can do union shape. That's it. Now I can change the color, I can apply quick style, I can do whatever I want and that is how all the other numbers were created in this list. So that is how you create creative designer numbered list in PowerPoint. You can take this idea to a whole new level if you combine some interesting animation because usually whenever you uh, present a numbered list you present it one at a time and let me show you some very creative ways in which you can use custom animation to add style to the numbered list in PowerPoint. The first example that I'm going to show you is that of three terms and definitions. On click you have these three numbers appearing. On the first click you have the term 1 being pointed, pointed to and then on the next click 
the arrow goes to show its definition the same thing happens with 2 and associated definition 3 and the associated definition let me show you another way in which you can use custom animation to make your numbered list come alive this is about five related factors first we show this 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 on each click you have the number and the associated text coming in opposite directions now once everything is explained then on a click you have all the numbers going and all the associated text aligning itself in this beautiful order let me show you another example here we talk about sliding blocks animation on first click the first block appears and then you have a number uh, associated text for it and on the next click you have the next one next one next one and so on so that is how we use sliding blocks animation let me give you one last example of numbered list with five numbers here we have really gone a little bit little overboard to add some animation which is truly uh, exciting so we have number 1 coming here and then the associated text here 2 and this is how it appears if you are a busy business presenter who doesn't have the time to create such professional looking animations for yourself you can always take a look at our off the shelf solutions like our 630 plus advanced custom animation templates for powerpoint there are more than 630 highly advanced custom animation templates which you can uh, use by replacing sample text hope you like the tutorial on creating designer numbered list in powerpoint if you want to learn more such tutorials if you want to um watch more videos like the one that you've just seen you can always visit us at presentationprocess.com thanks a lot for watching the video and happy presenting